let's get to the videos. Hello? Oh my God. what's your emergency? It's, it's my wife. She, she's, she's gone and everything's... Oh. Sir? Sir, can you explain to me what's happening? I, I don't know what's happened. There's blood everywhere. She's not here. My wife's not here. Okay, well, can you give that one to Mummy? Thank you. You're welcome. You want to taste it? Just a little bit? No. Okay, okay, okay. What cereal it is. Ah, come in. There we go. Do you have surgery today? Oh, my sister said that she'll do it, so just figure bring it back here after we go shopping. <gasps> Auntie Lee? Yes, Auntie Lee. And she can't wait to see you. That is all. I will see you after school, okay? Okay. Have a good day. You there it is. Privilege of every heart surgeon. To be able to hold the lives of our patients in our very hands. To have the opportunity to be either a savior or a failure. That's why this opportunity should not be taken lightly. And why mistakes are never an option. Understood? Good morning. You're here early. Did you get the revised designs? Uh, I actually was getting ready to look at them right now. Remember this? <laughs> Client just called said it's been the most successful product launch in their company's history. Another reason why your award tonight is so well-deserved. Aw, I love it. Uh, we can pop it open during lunch today and everyone can have a drink. Oh, no, that's... <laughs> but, uh, I'll see you tonight then. Maybe we'll raise a glass then? Of course. I feel better already. Thank you, Doctor. Oh, well, let's just take them and give you the hundred. What is that? A hundred. A hundred? How's the job job going? Well, I have a waitressing interview. Yes, and I have another one at that hotel on 5th. As a front desk clerk, don't make yeah, a big deal. See, that's a good thing that we went out and got you these clothes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait a minute. What is going on in here, huh? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Check I got an idea. What? How about you pack all this up for my place so these two can get ready for mommy's big night? <gasps> yeah? <laughs> yeah, let's do it! Oh, Ed, you have to see this dress she just got. It is smoking. Oh, <laughs> come on, come on, come on. She's so modest. Smoking, right? Wow. Yeah. I thought it was you doing the shopping. See, that's exactly what I said. Yeah, well, you had to wear a hand-me-down to your graduation. And look, I know you dreamed of wearing a dress like this for your valedictorian speech, so you owed it to your 18-year-old self to buy it. Don't be so hard on yourself. But trust me, once you see her in it, you will thank me. <laughs> Jade, I didn't know you were valedictorian. Of course she was. <laughs> Come on, look. Thank All you. right. Love you. I'll see you later. See you. Wait, wait, wait. Hmm. Yeah. I better go get ready.
This one would have made you look like a whore. Where is your hard-earned award going? Uh, the mantle? The office? The bedroom? <laughs> I don't know yet. Well, you gotta show it off, because uh, what can I say? This one, it... It's not like I'm saving lives. <laughs> no. Ah, that reminds me. My doc says I may have a little murmur. Any chance I could get a second opinion from the best heart guy in town? <laughs> Rob, leave the man alone. Well, I'd be happy to. And here, a toast to my heart and to Jade, Perception's most creative and outstanding leader of the year. Oh, sorry. Never touch the stuff. Come on, it's the after party. Mm. Gotta keep the hands steady. Uh, well, not me. In fact, I'm gonna see about getting another bottle so we can all toast, huh? <laughs> Ah. You and I have a special day coming up. Hmm, that's right. Ten years. Mm -hmm. Would you like to celebrate it like last year? The Chateaubriand at Alouette? Oh, well, it's your favorite, so, of course. Before we crack this one, Jade, a few words. No, I, I already gave my long-winded speech at the no, ceremony. No, 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 no. We want more. Okay, all right, all right, all right. Um, well, first, my team has to come up here with me. Um, wow. This award, you know, if I could put your names on it or if I could split it into three, I would, because I can't do what I do without you guys. Well, to Jay, yes. Love you too. It looks like Lee and Kay had a good time. <laughs> Jade, don't be naive. Your sister's been back in your life for a few months, and bipolar's hard to manage, even with meds. All right? Give that Liam quite a lot of credit tonight. No, oh, he's just part of the team. I gave them both credit. Then why couldn't he wait to get his hands on you? Humiliating. Um, it's just work colleague, you know. Liam, Jen. <laughs> you think it's better than me, don't you? No. Just tell me the truth. You think I'm stupid? No. But I don't know why you begged me to go back to work. I just needed to work. It just, it helps me. Oh, here we go. That's right, poor depressed Jade. You don't seem to remember that I'm the one who was there looking after you when you had nothing. No one. I'm sorry, Ed. You're sorry? What did you do? <laughs> what did you do? Just tell me what you did. Tell me. Please, please. What did you do? <laughs>
Daddy, did you get Mommy more flowers again? I sure did. Do you know why? No. Because she's my little flower. <laughs> <laughs> I refilled your prescription at the hospital. Thank you. Kayla, if you're finished, you can uh, go ahead and play for an hour before bed. <gasps> okay. <laughs> Oh. Um, the realtor called. Your mother. Don't need any reminders of that trunk. Did you work today? Yeah, from home. You know, I think it's a good idea if you make a habit of that. Ed, I'm expected to be at the office at least a few days a week. Then quit your job. I mean it, Jade. Oh, I, I can't. I'm, I'm in the I'm middle of a project right You're now. You're a team. We'll pick up the slack. It's a hospital. <sighs> I've got to go. Don't wake up. Have a bad dream? No. Oh, what's wrong? I'm going to get you do, Mom. Have you given your notice? No. We discussed this, all right? Get it done. I'll be home after dinner. Okay. Hey, sweetie. Hi. Ooh. Enjoying your breakfast? Yes. Kayla to sleep in the guest room. Thank you. Is she okay? No. Yeah. She doesn't really understand what's going on. But it's better to be here than somewhere strange. I'm here for you. Both of you. I won't bail on you like I did last time. Sisters? <laughs> Sisters. Okay. <laughs> Enough of this mushy stuff. You hungry? Jade? Jade?
Why are you here again, Ed? Let us bring you these. Brighten your day. Where's Kayla? Lee is picking her up after school. What does your sister think about all this? If you're wondering if I told her anything, don't worry. What is there to tell, Jade? You broke up our family, and I'm worried about you. We're fine. You're not fine, Jade. Depression doesn't go away. I remember how well you were after your parents' accident. I think your sister coming back has stirred that all up again. Just come home so I can help you. Oh, thank you, Liam. I'll see you Friday when you pick Kayla. Quits, man. Yeah, I know. I'm still trying to get my head around it, if I'm honest. Jade's obviously going through something. Yeah. Well, I'm not telling Wendy you're on the market because she'd leave me in a red hot <laughs> Come on. Sergeant Dow, you run this town. Yeah, true, but you saved her with that triple bypass, so I think you got one up on me, you know? Go, Kayla! Oh, good job! Good job, good try. That was an incredible... I think I just had a good read on them. <laughs> you always know what the client wants, even before they do. Thank it's you. amazing, really. Thank you, Liam. All right, I should probably get going. I'm already late, but I will see you tomorrow. That you will. Yeah. Good night, Jade. Good night. Hey, Lee. I'm sorry, my meeting ran over. Yeah, but I'm, I'm on my way now. <laughs> Thank you. Ed, what are you doing here? I don't know what. You can screw that leech near him with a clear conscience. Let go. <clears throat> Let go, or I'll file a restraining order. And how would that look? Go ahead and try, Jade. No one's going to believe you. I save lives, remember? And everyone thinks you're crazy, that you should be with me. I'd rather die than be with you. And I'd rather cut you up in a million little ways than let anyone else have a piece of you. God, I'm so happy you got into this house. I know. I'm so lucky. All right. <laughs> I think that that is the last of the gifts. Yeah. Mommy, when is Daddy coming? Well, you and your Daddy get to celebrate your birthday again this weekend together. Mm -hmm. Okay. All right, now why don't you take this upstairs and you can play with that. <laughs> and me and Auntie Lee are going to clean up. Yes. And put your pajamas on. Okay. So, and the papers? My lawyer got them back today. Wow. So that's it, huh? Yeah.
We'll go warm up with the team. I'll be right there. Hey. Hey. This is Diane. Jade. It's nice to meet you. My oldest plays in the same league. Oh, boy, it's a... It's a good league. I should go talk to the coach. Yeah. I'll see you. Girlfriend? Hey, if you want to come by the house and pick up your oh, stuff... Oh, no. I'm good. Well, look, unfortunately, I'm going to be away for a conference for a few days. So I won't be able to take Kayla for my weekend. So no Can I come and grab her a few hours when I'm back? Yeah. Take care. You too. Hmm. See you guys next week. Caught you. I wanted to ask you earlier, but you were so busy. Um, did you want to maybe get together this weekend, uh, grab a drink or some food? No. Oh. Okay. <laughs> See you in the office on Monday. Oh, Jade, hey. Hey. What are you doing here? I was, um, um, gonna check in on something. Oh. Well, can I help? I am the boss. Right. By the way, I was really sorry to hear about you and Ed. So, who knows? Maybe you can find a way to work it out. He's good people. You know, I was gonna ask about something with the school. Zoning matter, it's fine. I can just have the board follow up. You sure? So, yeah, I can help. thank you. No, 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 it's good. It's good. Okay. See you later. See you. I didn't tell anybody. I should have saw it. I should have. No, but her. And he was good to me. He was there for me when mom and dad died. And then, um, one day we were at a friend's house. And I corrected him on something. I can't even remember what. But when we got home, that was the first time. And I rationalized it, you know, I rationalized it to his mother always cutting him down. But after that, it, it was like everything I did. Oh, Jade. And I swear, I will never let him hurt you again. I don't think you can. Oh, that's 
the case, you have no choice but to go to the police. His best friend is the police sergeant. And I know Ed. You're turning around. He'll make me seem like I'm the crazy one. She's the one who had the nervous breakdown. Another one he had to save. Then what are you going to do? both lunches to eat at the park. <gasps> Can we get ice cream? Yeah, of course, sweetie. Jade, I don't think you should be alone. I think you should go with us to the park and we can figure out a plan for you to get out of here. Um, um, okay, baby, why don't you go get your jacket, go to the park? That is beautiful, sweetie. Thank you. Don't worry, okay? But if something does happen, I need to know that you're gonna be. Trust me. All right. All right. Uh, okay, sweetie. Are you ready to go to the park? Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna see you, mommy, all right? I want you to be a good girl. Okay. And I want you to listen to Auntie Lee. Okay. okay. And I want you to remember that mommy loves you so much. I love you too, mommy. Yeah. Okay. All right, kiddo. You ready? Let's do it. Thank you. After performing 1,000... 248 life-saving surgeries. I still believe I can do better. In fact, we all can. And with what I will share today, I hope we will. Most of us in this room have devoted our lives to cardiothoracic surgery, so I don't have to tell you that work-life balance has not been high on our agendas. Thank God for my... We have been tasked with supporting the most vulnerable cases. And it is my hope and desire. With our skills and dedication, we never have to lose another patient on the OR table again. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. 1,240 years in council. Don't be so modest. <laughs> everywhere and she's not here well she's not here my wife's not here we're sending someone out right away okay what do you want for dinner you think like macaroni and cheese maybe yeah macaroni and cheese <gasps> daddy 
Hey, Dr. Kayla. How are you? Good, Daddy. Good, good. What's going on? Where, where's Jade? I don't know. What do you mean? Look, now's not the time. The place could be in time. Please! It's hard enough for everyone. Yeah. Yes, me. The cops are still there, but it looks legitimate. I don't care what you do. Just get rid of the body. And we're done. I'm gonna make sure you tell them yourself. You said Jade has a history of depression. Yeah, she does. It started after her parents died. I helped her get it under control, but about a month ago, I noticed her spiraling again. What about the abuse? Jade doesn't drink or use any other drugs. We don't even keep alcohol in the house. The physical abuse. I'm sorry I don't follow. Jade's sister came out of the station. They thought you were trying to have her killed. I'm... I'm sorry. I don't know where Lee would have gotten that from, but you're aware she's bipolar, aren't you? And the drug problem. I mean, she disappeared for almost 10 years, living on the streets. She didn't tell you any of this. No, no, she didn't. Lee has some really shady people around. She even claimed she was being followed. Now, I don't know if that was in her head or if it was real, but now she's telling these stories about me? Why? Well, because I have my reservations about her. Wouldn't you? Well, thank you, Dr. Thompson. You've given us some leads we can follow. Thank you. I'm detectives. What do I tell my daughter? I would tell the truth. You don't know where her mother is. My wife. 
How does it feel to be Mrs. Thompson? Perfect. Got my purpose all I need. Well, from now on, you <laughs> are my little flower. Dr. Thompson. This is Alouette calling just Thompson. Shall I confirm it? Hello? Apparently there's a reservation under Thompson. Here we are, for two, right this way. Our did arrive for your table, so if you'll just follow me. A server will be right over with the wine list, but the chef has already been instructed to prepare you and your wife's anniversary dish, the Chateau Briand. Enjoy.
I need to talk to you about Jade. Why? I think so. Look. She made a dinner reservation for us. For our anniversary. I just need to know. Did you do that before? To reconcile? Seriously? You tried to kill her, Ed. So trust me. She wasn't planning on celebrating her anniversary. And let me tell you something. If anything has happened to her, I'll kill you myself. Got the cash and her body is dealt with. So now we're done. Babysitters. You did? Okay, well, maybe we can tell Kelly all about it when we get there, okay?
In four hours, some of you will be assisting me with what will be your first transcatheter surgery. So it's important we go over the procedure. We want to be prepared for every eventuality. Now, in the first slide, you'll see the aortic valve in question. Now, this is where we'll be placing the catheter. Uh, I'm sorry, this is... Dr. Thompson? Get out. I said, get out! Why don't you answer your damn phone? We were done. Oh, well, I wouldn't know if you did the job. You saw it. Cops saw it. Then why the hell does it feel like she's still alive? What you said you were going to do. Is that the proof you're looking for? She never took this off. I told you I did the job just like I got paid to. So whatever's going on, it's your deal. Don, going somewhere?
okay? Daddy just needs to save a few more lives. You. I... No, no. I'm so sorry. I just wanted to make you some dinner. You look. You look just like. I should go. What is it? Tattoo you told us your wife has when you gave us a description. Who sent this? Never couldn't be traced, but we're working on it. And we need you to confirm it with us. Is that Jade's tattoo? Identification and these images, it's sure, but look at this. She has to be dead. How can you not be sure? Juice? Yeah, of course. Look, Kayla, look, Daddy's got to go to work. Okay. So can you um, go and get your school bag? And Kelly is going to come and take you to school. But I don't want Kelly. Just do it! Look, Daddy's just tired. I need you to listen to me, okay? Just go and get your bag. Okay. Thank you. Come in. I saw on the news. Are you and Kayla okay? We're fine. Thank you. I'll see you tonight, okay? Okay. Thank you, Kelly. Bye.
ojos. I'm so sorry. I just saw the news this morning. If I'd known, well... We got lucky your team stepped up just now, but it can't happen again. Take a leave. You need it. I need to go. Look, it was just today. I mean... I'll be fine. No, be fine. no, no, no. I'm your best surgeon. They could smell the alcohol on your breath, Ed. If it were anyone else, you'd be losing your license right now. So go home. Look after yourself. Me too. Get some help. tomorrow for Jay Thompson, who disappeared from her home under suspicious circumstances. I have this to say, whoever did this, and you know who you are, you killed a beautiful soul, and I hope that it haunts you forever. Thank you.
Where are you? What happened here, bud? Someone break in? I know we don't have a body, but you saw yourself. Jade's dead. You saw the photos. Uh, no, I'm sure you don't understand. She will never leave. She can't. She is here. She's here right now. Gail's gonna go into child protective services. Okay? No. Listen to me. Hey. I'm sure it's just temporary, but come on, right now it's for the best. Good. It's okay. Be right back. I'm here in downtown Hannondale, where people have come together to remember Jay Thompson, whose disappearance and apparent murder. Thank you. Hi. Hi. I just, uh, just wanted to stop by. Tell you, I'm sorry. Thank you. Uh, Sergeant Daly, right? Yeah. Ed's right. friend? Mm-hmm. Right. Um, is he here? Uh, I don't know. I haven't seen him. But, uh... Mm. But to tell you the truth, he hasn't really been himself lately, so... Yeah, then you should stay. <sighs> At night, to remember my sister. I, um... have a few words I'd like to... I have a few words that I'd like to read that have been prepared. Jade used to think she can do anything. And she could. She was unstoppable. And then one day, we lost our parents. 
And there was nothing she could do about that. Ed, the savior of lives. Jade had it all again. A career where she could shine. A loving, beautiful daughter. And then she had Ed. Her steady hand. But how steady is it now, Ed? Hmm? Because even saviors like you can be haunted by ghosts. And those ghosts, they will multiply and they will grow and they will never leave you alone. Not until you're caught in the haunting, she won't stop. It, it won't stop. Hello, Ed. You bitch. Is that all you got? Because I am so much more. I died. And I came back so I could destroy you. Yeah. It was me. I did all of it. You're still dead, Jade. It's me. Stay dead. Because I'm going to kill myself. Let her go, Ed. Let her go. Ed. I told you. I'd rather die than be with you. Come on. Come on.
girl. Where did you go, Mommy? When you get a little bit older, I can tell you. Okay. So, I think that we should go to the park and we should get some ice cream. Yeah. So, what kind of ice cream? 